Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel, Animal Crossing Island Tours with me, and of course, I'm Mimi. Right now, I am on the Island of Nature Walk, and if you can see by the flag, it is just a really nice nature-filled island that has that foresty, um, oceany feel to it. I really enjoy this island, and I hope that you guys will too. I wanted to show you the map real quick. There are going to be three houses that we can look into on this island. And um, I wanted you to see that. And also that way you can also see the dream address to this island. If you guys are aware that we are in the Island of the Month tour. So if this happens to be your favorite island, we are now voting for the month of April. Be sure and let me know by leaving a comment underneath the island that says, hey, this is my Island of the Month choice for April. And um, if you subscribe to the channel because of this island, please also say I subscribe because I love the Island of Nature Walk. So right now, I just wanted to let you see in front of this is the Abel's and of course Nook's. Look how cute this little character is. Um, and here we are. I wanted to walk around, let you see everything. You have the cute little luggage. Here's a really pretty little bridge. You're coming through here. This has just got some uh, really nice flower area. You've got the big um, butterflies in here. Walking real slowly through here. At least it's a dream, so I can't mess up any flowers. The beaches are open, so you have plenty of room to run and do. I'm not sure how many hours this island has been played, but it is a very fun island. So we're going to come back out and walk across this little area so you can see everything. Look at that. That is just crazy. That big old dragonfly in the middle of the walkway, the waterway. Going up here, you have the benches and the beautiful statues that lead up into this museum area. And there is a nasty T-Rex waiting to eat me. Uh, very neat. I love to see all of the different fossils that are put together and sat around um, islands. So that makes that really fun. You do have the natural wood benches all throughout this island. Uh, love the paths. Be sure if I haven't pointed out something up on the terraforming to take a look at the terraforming. Uh, there's different things to see like notice the little uh, directional signs some of these paths are very creative and neat as well look at how cute this is uh, the little mushroom has a scorpion on it this is what you would see if you were coming off of the airport and i find that to be a really nice pleasant view right there you have the moon and a mushroom lamps with a little parasol mushroom parasol over here is the beach area there's some sitting areas hello you do have a little fish shop right here, a big old sunfish to buy from. Look at that. There's a pearl. You have your fish bait you can purchase. Just a nice little area that you can join and enjoy. All of this, um, this island happens to be a giving island. All of this is here in stalls and they're giving this away for free so there's DIYs, all that kind of stuff so if you wanted to get in touch with the creator of this island please message me and hopefully i can get with you guys and maybe you guys can get together and you can get some of this free stuff that they have set out okay we're going to go over this little bridge take a look here is that not just a pretty little site we're going to come this direction and look there's just neat little area over here where they have their little scuba gear, their little surf shop over here where you guys can get your stuff to go play in the water, sand, all of that good stuff, that ocean life feel. Got your tiny library. Very neatly done. So we're going to follow this path over here and we're going to come. Here is the little pumpkin patches. Is this not too cute? And then the orchard, as you can see, all throughout the orchard, everything is labeled, very precisely sat and done, and lined up very nicely. Out here is where they're boxing up all of that fruit and sending it off to, I bet you, needy people, because this is a giving island. Um, hey, I'm needy. So, but people who might could use this fruit, I find that really neat. Islands that are just establishing and could use some help. That's awesome. So here we go. We're going to come around this way. 
looking at all the stuff we see here. And then this says, Nature Walks Villagers, Villages. So here we are in a first house that we go to, and it's up here in the Nature Walk Village. Look at the little waterfall. You've got the cute little tent up there that's in the terraforming, the little horse. Just wanted you to see all this direction going. We'll go back and take a look, but thought this would be fun for you to see. And here we go into our very first house. Like that blue on that, that house. Kind of a nice, peaceful color. Uh-oh. Area as well. All of these three houses are nicely decorated. Look at this. This is a very cool bathroom. Sauna. I love that yellow right there on that um, washing machine. That looks kind of cool. Place to do your business is in here. All of the things that are very important in a bathroom. Nice. Let's see what else we can find in this really well-decorated home. I do love the this little simple green rug, and you just kind of can sit back and enjoy the wood fireplace there. And let's see, kind of a stove thing. Oh, this is a cool sitting area, bedroom. I guess this is a bedroom. Ooh, that's neat. Very unique, very different. Then we're going to come in here and see what else we can find. Nature's Walk is a very different, very nature island all the way through. I really enjoy the theme throughout this island because even inside the home, you feel like you're more of a nature kind of a house. Um, this is really neat. Got the ironwood furniture, the ironwood stuff, and then the stove in here and a nice refrigerator, microwave. Nicely done. I think that's the simple white wall. I'm not sure, but that's what I believe that is. And let's see what we have upstairs. Dun, 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 dun. So are you guys getting ready for bunny day? Neat. Okay, so we have another natural area, a little natural greenhouse type room. All of the plants are in here. Nice. Got your bamboo shelves, your cypress plants. Nicely done. And let's see what else we have. Downstairs we go. Where we stop? Only Mimi knows. And down here we have... Oh, cool. A real nice just family room, place to listen to music, do your homework, play some games, just enjoy family time. Nicely done. Watch a little television. And here we go. Like the game sitting out makes you have a homey feel. Reminds you of like when I grew up, we used to have uh, my grandparents had a cabin that we went to up in the mountains. And it was just so nice just to kind of go and, and hang out there and play games. We always played board games in the evenings and of course went fishing and whatever in the day. So coming around this way, look at the nice little path. It's all natural. You have your little well. Um... Reminds me of a wishing well, but um, in the garden, nasty tarantula, however. And here we come into the last house. So let's take a look. In here we have a sitting area. Got the little tea table that you can make with the sitting area. The vintage record player and the steel wall. Over this direction, a very rustic and nice bedroom. You've got the antique bed with the wood wardrobe and the wood table and the wooden walls. Really reminds you of that cabin type feel in that room. And maybe this is, uh, I'm not sure what the walls represent in here. Maybe it's just more of a I don't know, like a storage room or something. 
And in here is a decorated bathroom. Pretty simple in there. Just you have your imperial separating you, the little panel there, so not everybody can see you're doing your stuff. And that's nice, a nice little bathtub in there. And we come in this kitchen area and we have, okay, we have a table with the cloth and nicely done. Little nice kitchen area. Somebody's making me a cake or maybe pancakes. Don't know, but that's what it feels like. Of course, they also have the vegetables on there. So I don't know. Maybe it's dessert. Going up. Here we go, and cool, this is a very fun game room. Got your basketball goal and your football mat and everything to have a game area. And then we're going to head downstairs and see what they have. I will be sure and ask the creator of this island how many hours they've put in. Um, this is Nature's Walk. I want to remind all of you guys that we are in the Island of the Month contest. So if Nature's Walk is your favorite island, be sure and leave a comment underneath the video. Let me know that, hey, this is the island I vote for for the month of April. And I want to say thank you guys for watching the channel. We're going to walk back through some of the island. And um, I think this is pretty well. The Island of Nature's Walk. But let's look and see. Hello, sweetie. Nice little sitting area out here. Let's go back around. Down this path. It's all natural. We're going to hop over. Hop again. And this is where all the little villagers live. Up here's where we just were. So it kind of rounds around. That's cool that you can round around either way. You can either go down or back up from here. This is all villager area. So neatly done. Definitely love this. Love the way that it's laid out. This island is laid out really cool. Going up and down where you can see. I love how every little villager home is decorated. You can just take a nature's walk. Literally, you can just go on a natural walk through nature and see everything. So cute. So well done. Love that. And, I, and if you haven't noticed, and if you... I don't know if you might have or not, but the pine trees, the spruce trees um, are all different sizes. So that makes it really interesting and dynamically cool because it makes a different aesthetic. Coming out here is the little camp area. You have your moons. This is just lovely, lovely little area. This is customized with the flag on there. It looks like the flag of the island. Nice little seating area. Really enjoyable. Love that campsite sign. Such a nice area. Ooh, not so big on the praying mantis thing, but nicely done. Okay, I have a feeling we have seen the island of nature's walk. I'm going to cut back through the flowers. Go back over the bridge. And I want to tell you guys, thank you so much for coming with me on this adventure. Um, thank you for watching my channel. Without you, I couldn't do it. If you have an island you would like me to tour, as I say, it doesn't matter if you play 200 or 2,000 island um, hours. I love to tour islands. There's always something creative to see. Please be sure and, and write me a little note, a comment that says, hey, come to my island, Mimi, and I will get to it as soon as I can. And um, if you like what you see, please hit that subscribe button. And thank you once again for, um, for this journey.